hauntingly beautiful. That's the first two words that immediately spring to mind when you lay eyes on Glen Isla. Now, Scotland is one of the world's most iconic hunting destinations, but for good reason. The terrain is challenging and the animals wary, selecting lofty vantage points in impossible locations. To successfully harvest one of these magnificent creatures, your mind, body and equipment must be rugged, reliable and prepared for the worst that Mother Nature can throw at you. This is what the Isuzu D-Max Huntsman was built for. Today we're following the adventure of Dominic Scheidt, of legendary rifle manufacturer J.P. Sauer & Sons. Like the Huntsman, the new Sauer 101 was built to perform in extreme conditions, and we're going to put it to the test. So Dominic, this is your first time ever hunting in Scotland for red stags. It's got to be pretty exciting. It's going to be exciting. It's completely different to uh, Germany hunting, mm -hmm. uh, like high sea hunting. We're going to stalk a lot and that's going to be tough and a lot of fun. Yeah, well let's hope so. Now uh, we've got the perfect vehicle to get us there, but right here with the Sauer 101, you think you've got the perfect rifle. So tell me, why is the 101 perfect for hunting in these conditions? Uh, the condition's going to be quite tough. Uh, fog can turn up pretty quick, uh, most of the time very wet conditions, so uh, we have a synthetic rifle here, lightweight, mm -hmm. accurate. What you need is a reliable rifle. We have enough rounds here, five rounds and a uh, smooth bolt, nice safety, so that's going to be perfect for that kind of stalk. So it also comes fitted um, with a, a threaded barrel for a silencer. Exactly. It already comes with its bolt stirred ready for, for the moderator. Yes. Uh, and as you say, it's uh, an incredibly rugged and reliable rifle. So, we've got the rifle, got the truck, let's get suited and booted. All right, and let's go. Dominic heads up the mountain in the Isuzu D-Max Huntsman, which makes easy work of the rocky terrain. As he moves closer to the top of the mountain, there's a thick fog all around and he heads out on foot with his stalker, Bill. So the plan is just now, is we're going to have a walk around the side of the hill here. We've seen some hounds just down at the back here. So we need to have a better look and see if there's any stag with them. Uh, and then we'll plan it from there. So we'll just go down here quietly, stay in the out of sight of them and drop in over and see what there is. Okay. The guys haven't gone far when Bill spots the herd. Now it's about 100, 150 animals and uh, a few young stags. So it seems like that they noticed us, so we try to walk around. They head into the thick fog on the top of the mountain to come around the herd for a better view. A huge herd moves across the mountainside. They're way out of range from here but Dominic Sauer 101 is poised for action. We spotted the uh, herd again, we've seen before. They are 450 metres that way, but mainly hinds and only one or two young, young stags, two young stags, so we keep moving and uh, try to find uh, different ones. Bill heads on through the fog and he spotted another opportunity found some more deer over on this other side of the valley. So we're just going planning on going down here and across on the far side there and round the far side. They head down the valley into the bottom, across and onto the opposite mountain. There's another big herd of deer on the mountainside, but they've spotted Dominic and Bill. The guys continue along the side of the opposite hill and move closer to another group just over the ridge. Be very careful now that they don't see us. Keep trying, keep low. Okay. They head in slowly and drop to the ground. However, the herd are heading their way and soon spot them. Bill gets Dominic set up and they select their stag. 
The herd begins to run and their stag gets further and further away. Before disappearing over the crest of the hill and up the next mountain, out of range. The opportunity passes and Dominic's stag has moved on. With it being so late in the day and there being such a long walk back, the guys head down the valley and back to the lodge. Tomorrow is another day. Dominic and Bill start day two on the top of the mountain and visibility is much better. We spot it, nearly 20 red deer, uh, two stags, and the rest are cars and hanes across the valley. Uh, and about, I don't know, a thousand yards away. They move on and there's another herd in the valley. But this one is even further away. It's a group of ten on top of the hill. Yeah, two thousand yards away. Bill moves on, determined to find Dominic his first Scottish red stag. Bill has Dominic climbing the steep hillsides, and it's very different from a traditional German hunt from a comfy high seat, that's for sure. But he needs to work if he wants to get his first Scottish red stag. Found a few tracks here. Very moist ground here and very wet. All those little uh, waterfalls, and so you can see the tracks right here and there, all around here. So a good spot for a deer. The guys hit the deck and make their way in. The herd have their eyes peeled and are looking in every direction. Dominic needs to move slowly to avoid being spotted. Bill instructs him which stag to take. Dominic gets the stag in his sights and he fires. The stag doesn't appear to react to the shot and turns to run. The rest of the herd make a dash for it. However, the shot is good and the stag doesn't get far. Got a red stag now, finally, made it. After, I don't know, three, four hours of stalking. Finally spotted a group and uh, got a young red stag in there, shot him. And he went down, went like, I don't know, 50, 60 meters up the, down the hill and then he lay down. Okay, here's the stag. Finally, Done. yes. Got him eventually. Yeah. yeah. Just a young stag. Young stag. Well, uh, two years. Two or three years old. Uh, he's, just, he's just a young stag, but we need a good stag for the kitchen. It's a good in for, for the guests to eat. So we'll, we'll use this one for next week's guest. There you are, look. Uh, There's the entry hole. Yeah. The rifle did the job. Mm -hmm. Sour 101. Rifle's okay. Yeah. yeah. Nice knife. Dominic partakes in the age-old Scottish tradition and gets a comprehensive mm, blooding. Nice and warm, yeah. Here we go, well Scotland. Done. I like it. <laughs> <laughs>
To find out more about hunting with the Isuzu D-Max Huntsman, visit isuzu.co.uk.